and welcome back to Holden's Golden Age of Wargaming with part 12, turn 13, battle for Odino. Um, Alright, so we need to break through here. But looking at, just quickly looking at this. We don't have, as the French, we don't have the edge here. We don't have the edge at all. So I could easily get into trouble if I'm not already. Um, but we're starting to get more reinforcements. So we'll keep pushing, but cautiously, cautiously. I think it's the Russians that are under the wire here they need to get results right now before the French get all those reinforcements on so as the French cautiously we will try to take out this redoubt and try to push on the flanks so first off we have our reinforcements what do we have this turn Oh, goody goody. A 1 5 and a 2 2 5. So all coming on on B. Okay. Um, so the question is really I don't think these are going to be any good in the center. So up here, down here. Now, down here, kind of bottlenecked. But if we can break through, it's a clear run to where we need to go. So. I think I'll put the one five to go this way, and the two two fives, where there's probably going to be more chance for combat, going up this way. And we'll start with them since they're the easiest thing to move. So we go one, two, three, four, five. And Uh, now we gotta get past this river, don't we? We'll cross the bridges. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four. Can't make it across that stream right away. Uh, here we cannot move. We're in combat. Combat. And ooh. Well, he's gonna stay put to help. Now we could move through and go up here. Maybe that's what we'll do. Uh, let's go one, two. Now can we fight through the? I don't. I don't think we can. I don't think we can. Let's just see here. Yeah, put zones of control. Uh, it doesn't say anything about woods, does it? Oh, actually, I couldn't even do that. Because this is on a control. Right. Um, I guess we just stay there. This unit can't go anywhere. It's locked in combat. Combat, combat. Not locked. As long as the control do not extend across the river. I don't think we want to do a 1 to 5 attack, so we're definitely going to move you out of there. So the question is... Yeah, we're, and not only that, we're halved. It'd be 1 to 10. So that's not going to happen. But we don't have to attack. We don't have to attack because there's no zone of control. 
but we don't want the 2-4 to be there. If anything, we want the 4-4. Four, four. So, well, we don't like this, do we? So, 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2, 3. Uh, 1, 2. 1, 2, 3, 4. Hmm. Well, we don't want to go forward here. <laughs> we could go forward here and do a... Try to push him back, but then we have to move the whole line down to protect that 6-4 infantry. We don't want to do that. Do we try to attack that redoubt again? So we got 16, 13, 20. Try to push him out again? I think so. So let's go like this, this, this. Uh, that's not going to help this artillery. Now we could move up here. And then do a 6 to 5, a 1 to 1 attack here. We need to get you into the fight, is what we really need. Actually, it'd be better to put him there. Actually, we get to get. It still wouldn't help. 17. We need 34 points, so that's not going to happen. However, this artillery, nice to have it where this artillery is. Go five, seven. We could get a two to one attack here. Be nice to push this back. But is that tipping our hand too much? I would like. back but then we're here stuck out it just doesn't seem like a great idea yeah and this five it's coming here 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 and here these three hexes this really shouldn't even be there. But if he comes in, he has to attack all three. Oh, well, I'd love to attack, but I think discretion is the better part of the valor. So, we're just going to stay put. Scream at me all you want. That's what's happening. That's what's happening. All right, so remove markers. And we're now going to be on to combat. So we'll go left to right here. Oops, left to right. So very first attack is going to be here. We have uh, four to four. No, four. Yeah, we didn't really have much we could do about this. So four to eight. That's one to two odds. Yeah, that's not so hot. We get pushed right out of there. One, the two, and those are cavalry units. What do we need? A one or a two? No. A one. Otherwise, we retreat, and we really don't want to roll a six. That would be very bad. Well, that would be, okay, there is no exchange. No. Yeah, we don't want to roll a six. All right, here we go. Cavalry. I 
believe that's a one. And that is, we got very lucky there. French got very lucky. That is a defender retreat. So, he can retreat across here. And that's, or he could retreat here. Where do we, as the French, want him to be? I think going across that board, having to have his attack. Uh, so we're going to put him there. And we're going to move up again, advance into there. Fight for Borodino. Continue street to street. We're not going to attack here. We don't have to. There's no zone of control. So we do not have to attack. It's not happening. Uh, next attack is here. We have 6, 13, 20, 22. Not that it matters. Actually, I could save that and do a... No. no it's not much chance of that happening. So, uh, 1 to 1 odds. Because that's a 17. 22 to 17. 1 to 1. Once again, we try to push the Russians out of the redoubt. Uh... Use the cannon for this one. Why not? Here we go. Can we take it? Can we take it? Uh, no. Oh, it's a three. Uh, oh, wait a minute. That is a defender retreat. We take it. Okay, so we get to push him out. Obviously, there's only one way. These, this would be a displace. We leave this place, so it has to go back. Okay, now, so do we want to move in? <sighs> we don't get any of those advantages. So, what are we got? What are we looking at there? Well, if I win that combat there, uh, yeah, he can still protect. Well, hopefully, we win that combat. So, if we don't, let's go worst case scenario. We lose that. And then that would be 4, 9, 16, 21. Technically, it could be 28 to 7. Yeah, well, I mean, it's too good to pass up, but I have to take it. I have to take it. So the 7 4 is going to take it. In he goes. Uh. And now we're going to do this combat here. That's a one to one. And we really, really would like to win this. That would really come in handy. All right, muskets. Let's see what you got. Come on, boys. We need this. We need this. The French need it. Yes. Yes. That's the. The 14th. The 14th came through for us. And the only way for him to retreat is here. So he's got to displace that artillery there. Back he goes, and oh yes, we are definitely moving up. That helps us keep the redoubt big time. Very good, very good. Alright, next up we have this combat. That's a one on one again. Lots of one on ones. Uh, that's a musket. Come on. Wow, French can do no wrong. So, we can push him back here or here? Let's push him back here. Let's advance. Yes, that's going to be a... Well, it's going to make him have hard choices. We want to advance. Now, here is the final combat for the French. Six to three. That's two to one. And as we know... That could be an exchange. Now, if there is an exchange ruled here, they would lose that, their, their cavalry. We would lose our cavalry, but we would not lose anything else. The artillery is not affected by combat results. Negative. Uh, so we would lose a two, they would lose a three cavalry. So I'll take an exchange. It wouldn't be the end of the world by any means. So we'll use the cannons for this. Uh, here we go. Come on. Two to one. Let's see what we got. What do we got? Well, first, poor roll, really. So, two to one. 
four is still Defender Retreat. So, uh, well, there's only one more place for him to go. Back. Forward we move. And forward we... Oh, no. I don't think... I don't think the artillery can advance. For sure. So, uh, that is it for combat. So now we're going to remove the markers. And we're going to change to the Russian perspective. And that wasn't a great turn for the Russians, which what just happened. So, uh, first of all, can't move, can't move, can't move, can't move, can't move, can't, can't move. Well, he attacks across now, he's a five. Starting to look like he should probably. We should probably pull back. Uh, risk of exchange is pretty great, isn't it? Alright, so all day here. We need to take that redoubt back. So back here, going to come. Oh, it's the town. They can still fire. They can still fire. One, two range. So it's going to stay put. Uh, this is it, right? This is it. So right now we have 7, 12, 19, 19 to 7. It'd be nice to get two more points. 1, 2, 3. Okay, so those four are involved in the attack on the Redoubt. Uh, I think that gives us 22 to 7. So that's 3 to 1 odds. A good chance of taking the Redoubt back. Here we got a 4 to 5. So we don't like that. So we're going to have to add in this. That makes it... Uh, actually, I should probably... <sighs> my rule. I should have moved it up there. Um, one, and this guy needs to come in. One, two, oh, three. That's as far as he's going to get. So we're going to go there. And one, two, three, four. Okay. <sighs> Things are only going to get worse as the French get more and more reinforcements. However, to win the game as the Russians, all we need to do is hold the redoubts. So why? So I'm going to hold there now. Big question is this guy. Attacking across at 5 to 4, that's 1 to 1 odds. We move across, <clears throat> and what? Well, But this is starting to look vulnerable. Yeah. Yeah. Um. Hmm. But we could hold here for now. Just to keep them coming across the board. Uh. Could also go 1 2 and attack. That's not a good. That's not good. No. Be a one to one. It's not going to really do much. Really, we just want to hold the redoubts. Well, we can hold this forward for now. I don't see. I mean, well, I think we should. Maybe I'll bring you up. One, two, three. I think we'll stay like that. You're going to move here. And one, two, three. I'll get you in there. You're going to stay there. Okay, we're just down. These two are going to stay here for now. But these three we need to... Alright, so we could hit this guy. So if we go... Can't cut off this retreat completely. But one, two, three, four. 
one, two, three. And we get a two to one. And then we can go one, two, three, four. Uh, I could go one more. Let's see here. Four. And that's where we started. Um, so we have a total of three, six. That's halved going across the board. Three, six, eight, ten. Eight to four is two to one. Ten to four is two to one. It doesn't matter. So I think that's as far as you go for now. Uh, well, I should probably put it there. But anyways, now we're on to combat. So we have to do this fight here. Three to two. That's a one to one. One-to-one uh, -one combat, and we with the cavalry. Here we go. Let's see what happens to the Russians. That is a defender retreat. So we're just not able. To, so we're gonna move him, and we're gonna move back. So yeah, definitely, that's not good for the French. But the Russians so far are holding this pass. Uh, next we have five to five. That's another one-to-one -one attack. Can we push the trench back into the forest? Let's go. We do. So no, not much, no progress for the French. And we'll move this guy in. No progress for the French on the south flank. All right, so now we have. Oh wait, a minute. should probably remove burners and show this is attack. This is attack. This is attack. All right, now we're doing this attack. So we have nine, nine to five. That's still only one to one. Can we make some progress here? What is that? What is that? It's an infantry, some muskets. muskets. Come on, push them back. Push them back. Nope, that is not a pushback. That is an attacker retreat. So uh, we have to move back. Uh, the French can even push us here or here. I think the French are going to push us here. Now the French are going to move up. Yes, they are. Uh, <laughs> are they? No, I don't think the French are going to advance. Uh, yeah, I think that'd be biting off more than we could chew. I think. Now, if we do go there, we bring him down. We'd have a three on one and a five on nine. And two. Don't bring him down. If he comes down, that'd be a three against five. One, two. Uh, no, I think we'll, we'll leave him there. Uh, next up, we have a total of seven, 12, 19, 22, 22 to seven. This redoubt does nothing for French forces. 22 to seven is three to one odds. The Russians are hoping for a one here. They're hoping for a one. Uh, let's do cannon. Let's do the cannon. Russians are hoping for a one. Come on. The Russians get a three. On a three to one. That is defender retreats. So we at least take the redoubt back. And there's only one place that we can send that French screen to because the other two, well, he couldn't go there. But here would be a displacement. So back there he goes. And we have to move up. Oh. That creates. What's the better one to do? This is, of course, way better for our defense, so I guess we're going to move. Okay, the 10 4 guard infantry is not attacking across the board, uh, which leaves us here. Oh, we do have one more after this. So, this is two 
halved because it's going across the board. Plus six, that's eight. And it's two doubled in defense, that's four. So eight to four, two to one odds. Two to one odds. Cannon it is. Come on. That is a one. Uh, two to one, that's defended retreat. Now, once again, we'll push him back here. Once again, the 4 4 comes in. Seems to be a lot of much ado about nothing here right now. Maybe with this, this artillery here, we can change that. Um, okay, and then the final combat is here. It's cavalry attacking this. 2 to 1, 2 to 1 odds. Can we push the French cavalry back across that stream? Um, here we go. We get a 2 on a 2 to 1. We know that is defender retreat. And there's only one place for him to retreat back here. Do we move in? Do we move in and lock these two? I think so. Yeah, we'll go like this. And that is it for turn 12. Remove the markers. Okay, well. Here's my taking on this. Well, it's not an easy fight. <laughs> That's my take on it. For either side, uh, as the Russians, this is very fragile. The French can break through, get a lucky kill. Uh, it could get, it could hold like a house of cards real fast. But at the same time as the French, it's going to be hard to take those redoubts. It's going to be really hard to break through here. Right? It's There's no easy... And this these units here coming up, they're not really going to change much. This, these two coming up this way will definitely put more pressure on the Russians on this flank. For sure. Uh, but I don't know how we're going to break through here. It's such a bottleneck. Here we have more room to maneuver. Um... Anyways, that's it for this turn and this video. Uh, if you enjoyed the video at all, please hit go down right below the video and smash that thumbs up, that like button. Uh, I appreciate knowing if uh, people are enjoying these videos or not. Uh, until next time, guys, have a great night and take care.